Hello everyone, Crystal Fisher here and welcome to a brand new Crash Bandicoot 4 It's About Time mod. We are here playing as, well I'm not playing as Sonic because you know what, I thought that would be generic. You know, guys, you can go download it yourself, go play Sonic, go play it as Sonic. You can experience this as, uh, as, as Crash, you know, for this, this time. So this is the Emerald Coast, or should I say just Emerald Coast, from Sonic Adventure. I'm, oh, I, I'm blanking on whether it's one or two, and it just exposes me as a filthy Sonic casual. I have always liked Sonic, but I've never really gotten into Sonic like massively. And believe it or not, the game that I played, the games that I played probably most extensively was Sonic One on the i uh, on the iPod Nano, and I'm not kidding. Um, yeah, Sonic on the iPod Nano. Um, Sonic Heroes, renting it all the time and being abysmal at it, uh, like legit just being so bad at the game, uh, you know, it, yeah, I was bad, I got stuck, I remember on Team Amy, I, I made it like decently far, but yeah, so we got that, and then also Sonic and the Secret Ring, which I know is kind of hated, however, it has one of those boss ass, boss ass music tracks, you know that, let the beast below, I don't know how it goes, so yeah, Animal Coast, Created by user 619, once again, just absolutely killing it. Like, you, you name it, this guy, this guy has a mod for it. He's done so many mods, not just for Crash games, but other, you know, other games uh, here and there. Check it out. To download this, all you have to do is go to the download link. You also have to have the console injector, which is a very important piece of... Oh, look at this, we've got some... The challenge, got the challenge mode here. Okay, all right, let's just get out of there. Let's just, let's just get out of it. Um... Yeah, so, you know, we, we have, uh, yeah, so, so he, you know, you, you basically, you get the console injector, you install that, and then, um, what you do is you load up the game, after that, Jesus Christ, what is going on here? Okay, oh, he's got me. Um, let me get out of it. Um, yeah, so once, once you got the, once you got the console injector, you then, uh, yeah, you load up the game, and then you run the console injector, put the, I'm putting the instructions here, and I'll put the instructions, uh, in the description as well. Uh, how the hell is this working? It is not. We just jump across. It's look uh, as you can tell, not perfectly suited. It's definitely one of the weirder levels to mod. The other funny thing I find is like how like the skyboxes. Ah, oh, he's got me. The skyboxes are kind of wacky and all over the place. But you know what? You can't complain, folks. You got to be happy with what you get here. I love any kind of Crash Bandicoot mods. Uh, even if they are as uh, bizarre as this. One of the more bizarre ones as well, um, definitely, uh, what was it called? Oh, damn it, idiot. It was th this one where it's like the I'm ready level, I'm ready promotion or whatever from SpongeBob SquarePants movie. And it kind of worked like as a concept. Problem is I was struggling to get it to work from a, um, you know, technical standpoint like it actually was broken for me it wasn't it didn't actually allow me to like the lighting was all wrong I've got to figure that out um, you know the thing with crash modding is that it's it's pretty good but there's still kind of like reading trilogy there's still some issues the thing is playing this again one thing I noticed because the last time I played crash I was actually doing the crash uh, like original speed running like crash to it I noticed that, like you can't do the, the slide spin where you let go like in two where you get a bit further and anyway, some of you probably have no idea what I'm talking about but here we go. We're looking for the we're looking for some secret rings here because he's hidden like seven of them apparently. Question is is this is this gonna kill me? I think it is. I feel like it is. Um, I don't know. I'm worried. So I imagine that in Sonic, yeah, again, look at me being such a casual, you're just speeding through this level so quick, and it would be so fun as Sonic. That's the thing. What are, what's everyone's thoughts, by the way? Let's get into a debate. I know it's not exactly the right place, but tell me about tell me about Frontiers. Tell me, in one million words or less, whether it's worth uh, investing the money in it, because I know that it is, you know, basically a full price game at this point. Um, and, you know, I would love to know whether you guys think it is worth purchasing. To me, it looks pretty good. It definitely looks like a better open world than, than the Pokemon one. I played that at uh, Unlisted Leaves House a couple, about a week or so ago, and, uh, yeah, that was, uh, yeah. Yeah, that game was interesting. It's actually, it's funny how it's basically better playable on 
like on emulator that like, you can actually play it better with Yuzu. Okay, I'm just looking at this. Where, where are these Chaos Emblems? Need to find one. I'm just thinking that they're probably hidden. They're doing well. What's your, oh, oh, this is brilliant. Look at that. So I won't actually do all of this because I will actually save some for ye selves. Or oh, I'm filling this thing. something up here. I'm filling this something up there. Let's see. That's the thing. It's so weird playing. It's another weird thing about playing Crash 4 and actually being able to play Crash 4 with like move the camera like around and stuff like that. And that's because it's like the engine is very, you know, an Unreal Engine 4. You know, it's very adaptable, it's very much open to be able to change, be changed. Um, what they should have done is they should have figured out a way to get their jet board for certain bits. That'd be, that'd be wild, actually. Let's jump across, jump across. Oh, you f absolute freaking pleb. No! It's too far. Okay, checkpoint. Here we go. What is going... Look at this level design. This is insane. Oh my... Oh, oh I've, I've, I've messed it up. I've messed it up. Hold up. Alright, let's see what happens here. Okay. Will he... Alright. Let me, let, me, let me knock him out like this. Jump on him, jump on the head. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. Okay. Alright, this is terrifying. I love it. Whoa, whoa. There we go, there we go. We're out of here, we're out of here. Thank goodness. Oh, look. Is that the end of the level? Well, maybe, we'll, maybe I will cover the whole thing. No, we'll, we'll see. Actually, no, no. I, I can't believe I have not found one Chaos Emerald yet. The Emeralds of Chaos, uh, Gentle Torrid on Oaths one would be so angry at me right now. That's uh, one of my friends in the Spyro Speedrunning uh, ISGP Discord. And just a friend in general. All right, anyway. Just happened to list the place we're at. Okay, anyway, so maybe the, one of them's in here. No, no, no. I'm just, I'm just missing all of them, no matter what. It's probably, they're probably really so well hidden that, it, like, let's see. Oh, hold up. Is that, is that intentional? Look at this. Secret lore. Not quite, but almost secret law. That's the momentum there. That is what gets me. The the, the charge jump, like the, the sorry, not charge. Wrong wrong game. Um, it's the it, the way what when you use the momentum, like when you what's the word jump, like when you what's the, oh, I'm, trying, I'm losing the word. Though. I can't think of the word. It's like when you do the slide into a jump, it's like it's too much. They want you to just hurry up and shoot first. Yeah. See, it's like it's like it's too. Yeah. See, that was my fault there. But that was like it's too long. Like you've almost just got to jump over and just get him. Okay. There'd be a chaos emerald here. Is it? Is it related? No, I don't want. I don't want to risk it. Okay. At least we go. Oh. <laughs> That's just me being a total moron. How am I doing this sometimes? Sometimes I don't even know. Alright, let's go again. One last shot, and then if not, if I don't get it, well, you probably know because the video will be over, but I'll end it and I'll let you guys get up there yourself. Alright, guys, I am a real gamer. I am a real gamer. Absolutely. I'm taking it to my grave. Here we go. There we go. Quick. Quick and effective. Boom. There we go. Ooh. Alright, here we go. Let's put in here. Oh, camera's a little bit funky. Oh. Here we are. Yeah, camera camera is a little bit weird just because of some of the perspectives that you're in and you know how they'd compare to uh, say Sonic. Is this like a HD level mod though of it as well? Like I actually wanna know. This does, I couldn't imagine this being the exact one of when it came out. Whoa, look at this. I wonder if I can go down there. Let's see. No, oh that honestly, it seems doable. It honestly seems doable. Whoa. Yes. Got it. Oh, a real I am. Look at this. This is brilliant. Thank you, everyone, for all your support over the years. Because without you guys, I wouldn't have been able to figure out to jump to this area here and just skip all those enemies. All right, it's probably some kind of uh oh, oh, some kind of chaos emerald there that I'm missing. Oh gosh, if there, if there was, if there's is there actually a box counter here, 90 out of zero. Okay, good. It's out of zero. I was gonna say that would actually 
be insane. Like all the boxes in this level. And actually probably technically well kind of impossible actually. Because of the bit we gotta jump up. Okay, sorry about the camera there. Oh, secret area. Oh. Look at this. Yeah, imagine having to get these, you couldn't. Alright, can I have someone? Is this the same area? But like. What is going on here? I missed the building. Actually, it's actually off. Oh, Scum of the year. Okay, let's go again. One more time. One more time. One more death, and that's it. One more death, and the video's over. No, no, no. Ah, one more. One more. One more. Guys, okay. Actually, we'll technically we'll be, we'll be game over. So, okay. Here we go. Here we go. Keep going, guys. This is it. This is for you all. Okay. The question is. Okay. Got him quick enough. Oh. Yes. Okay, a Chaos Emerald. Look at that one. Clear gem almost. Yeah. There we go. Beautiful. Alright guys, this is it. Until I die. Every time I die. The band. Alright, maybe this maybe this should be the thumbnail. There you go. There you go. That's the thumbnail. That's your thumbnail. Absolutely wild. Look at these wall riding areas. Just exquisite. Absolutely exquisite. Exquisite. Well, guys, I got a Chaos Emerald, so honestly, I'm I'm not upset now. I, I'm leaving on a high. No matter what happens now, I got it. And actually, look at all these convenient... Look, I could technically... I could be a bit of a sneaky bugger and go, Well, oh, it's not a game over yet. Look. Let's make this the longest video. Ever. There we go. Well, it's actually not, it's not that long. Alright, where's the checkpoint? There we go. Alright, one more. Let's just... We'll, get, we'll give it one more go. We'll give it until I die. Every time I die, uh, yeah. Every time I die, I will b barter to come back. No. Okay, here we go. But yeah, very well done to user 619. Once again, honestly, the man is a legend. He really is a legend. Um, just pumping out these mods. I know he's got a Destroy All Humans mod as well. I think it's a Coco mod. Coco in Destroy All Humans, which is honestly pretty cool. Whoa. That was playing with fire there. Uh-oh. Yes. I am. You know, happy. Knowing that you're on your last death, oh, knowing that you're on your last death, it creates monsters out of you, but in a good way. I actually saw a movie called, uh, what was it called? Um, Seasons, no, Violent Night, which is like Silent Night, you know, Christmassy. It was very good, very funny. David Arbor, kind of just completely taking the piss. Yeah, this level was, okay, I thought this was going to be like a super short level because it's, it's um, because it's, uh, you know, Sonic, but like, yeah. Because it's actually like really, it's actually really long, like, with, you know, within reason. Oh, shit. Sorry. As this is happening, I'm swearing more. Breaking my demonetization. Actually, these as you can. I just say, yep, I'm swearing sometimes. You know, like in the video, get over it. Alright. There you go. Oh, checkpoint and a savior. Thank you. Honestly, I will say this about Crash 4. Weakest part about it, but to me. Just not enough, not enough masks. I just genuinely don't understand why they went to such a degree of, of no mask. Like, it was pretty much, no joke, impossible to get invincibility at some points. Like, it was basically just not something that I, I... I think I got it maybe once in the entire game when I played through. Oh, here we go. Speaking of, they know what they want. Thank you very much. Look at this. Perfect. Of course it doesn't change the music doesn't change because of that. I think we're done, guys. It is actually it is actually counting them. Look. 154. We did it. I, I you know I was gonna expect to not do it. Here's the thing, though. still six remaining chaos emeralds, so I, I, I feel like I haven't overly spoiled it, you know what I mean? Like I feel like I've I've still been reasonable to, to not show everything off. There we go. Beautiful. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really enjoyed making this little video for you. And of course, you know, it's exciting because in just a couple of days, we're going to have the, what is very, very, very likely to be the Wampa League announcement at the Game Awards. So be sure to be checking that out. I'll be trying to do like a live reaction to that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it, you guys. Really, very, very much appreciate it. Anyone that's still, that's still watching, still stuck around over the years, very much appreciate it. And I'll be back very soon. Goodbye.